mom, come now, let's interpret the food label Chivita. Chivita is used for our children. When we read this, then we know how much of it we can give to our children to drink every day. Yes, so this is Chivita. So they've told us what they have in the food product. Let's interpret what it says. Now, this is not Dietitian Michelle saying. The manufacturer is the one saying, and we are interpreting what the manufacturer has said. Are you with me? Good. So, Chivita, the quantity, the weight of these is 125 ml. Now, most food products will give you the nutrition information based on 100 ml or 100 gram. Then, some of them will be very kind and nice to give you the calorie or the nutrition information based on their recommended serving. So it makes estimation very easy. It makes interpretation easy. But when they don't do that, you have to do the math. And if you're not good in math, look for dietitians. We'll be very happy to interpret a food product for you. So how will you do that? Cross multiplication. Since this is 125 ml and the manufacturer provided based on 100 ml, we will do some maths. Yes, so what does that mean? In this Chivita, per 100 ml, the manufacturer says it has 39 calories. Very small, I like that. <laughs> so but when you do the math, it says, it means that in 125 ml, it has 48, let's just round it up to 50. It has 50 calories. Yes, 50 calories. For a slice of bread, a slice of bread should give you about 80 calories. So that means that you're going to be getting less than a slice of bread, the calorie, the energy in a slice of bread, about half of that is what you're going to be getting from this pack for children. Then, what about the carbohydrate content? It says that it has 9.9 .9 in 100 ml. So based on my cross multiplication, it means it has 12.4 grams of carbohydrates. Then for sugar, 12 grams. And for my estimates, that is about two and a half cubes of sugar. How much sugar have I been saying you should take every day? Five cubes of sugar, not more than that. But if you're very active, scientists say that you can take seven cubes of sugar. Now, cube, if you want to use teaspoons, then it can be the same thing as seven teaspoons of sugar. Yes, for people who are very active, but if they are not, you don't exercise, you don't do so much, you're not very active, then just limit your sugar intake to five cubes or five teaspoons of sugar. And something about sugar, it is not just the added sugar to your tea or your pudding, you should be estimating, no. So even the sugar in food products, you will have to put into consideration. So if this says that it has 9.7 grams of sugar, yes, that means two cubes, about two cubes or two teaspoons of sugar. So for the day, you still have three cubes of sugar. So you can add two cubes to your pudding and leave the remaining one just in case you eat biscuits or you eat bread, it will account for that. At the end of the day, you're not taking more than five cubes of sugar. So when you count just that sugar, oh, okay, I don't, some people will even tell me, Mr. Michelle, I don't take sugar. Some, 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 I don't eat sugar. When was the last time you took sugar? No, 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 I don't take sugar. I stopped to take sugar many years ago. Then when I start to analyze their food products, they eat bread, they eat meat pie, they eat donuts, they take juice. And I said, well, you say you don't take sugar? I said, yes, I don't add sugar to my food. You eat sugar, my friend. Yes, accept it, you eat sugar. You just don't know that the manufacturer has added sugar in that food product. And that is what I have come to help you estimate. So, talking about Chivita, how much sugar does it contain? About two cubes. Yes, so for children, that is okay because they can still obtain three cubes from their food or even from the biscuit that they're going to be taking with this. Just try to stay within that five cubes every day, as much as you can. So that even if once in a while they overshoot, they, don't, they go beyond the five cubes, they take up to 10 cubes, no problem. Why? Because you have tried to maintain that five cubes every day. And for those who have family history of diabetes, for children who are in families where father is diabetic, mother is diabetic, now is the best time for you to abide by this principle. If you can even go below the five cubes of sugar, if you can, that would be very good. So this has 
about 50 calories. Chivita has about 50 calories in this pack and two and a half cubes in this pack. The carbohydrate content is 12.4. There is no protein, says the manufacturer. There is no fat, says the manufacturer. Sodium content quite negligible. Then vitamin C, 7.5 milligrams, which is actually small. Yes, because in a day, every day we need about 60 milligrams of vitamin C. So if you're depending on the vitamin C content of this, it's quite small. So how much of this should you give to your child every day? That depends on you. All right? Make a very wise choice. <laughs> Bye.